In this video, I'm going to take you through the different roles you can play in filming video as evidence. I'll also highlight what it is that lawyers need to prove an illegal case. This will give us a good idea of the kind of footage we should aim to shoot. First off, what kind of documenter are you? If you find yourself unexpectedly being an eyewitness to an incident which you are able to record, you are what's called an accidental documenter. You can film the event and what follows as it happens in front of you, always remembering that your safety and the security of others should be your first priority. This kind of unplanned video can be incredibly valuable in drawing attention to human rights violations, particularly individual incidents. If on the other hand, you go out with the aim of capturing footage, which could be used to help as part of a legal case, you are what is known as an intentional documenter. Intentional documenters plan to be in situations to record human rights violations. If this is something you want to do, there are some important points to consider before you start filming. First off, safety. Safety should always be your first priority. Is it safe to go and film? Know your rights. Find out as much as possible what and where you can legally film. The rules are different in different countries and states. Protect yourself and your contacts. If there is a chance you may be detained and your equipment confiscated, it's a good idea to make sure you are not carrying anything that could identify your contacts. Make sure to erase your recording media securely before you go out. Don't carry any old recordings, photos, unencrypted contact details, messages, and so on. As an intentional documenter, it's useful to know what kind of videos and footage are useful in a legal context. To understand this, it's helpful to know a little about what's involved in prosecuting someone for an offense. In order to bring someone to justice for a crime, there are things that lawyers must prove. What crime was committed? Who committed the crime? How the crime came about? Providing evidence for this is a complicated process often involving different sources, forensic investigation, witness statements, documents, and multiple video angles. The intentional documenter can help by thinking carefully about what to film and how to film it. If you want your video to be useful to lawyers, it should be relevant. Relevant footage contains something that can help to establish the what and who and how of the crime. It's important to understand, though, that a single video by itself will rarely, if ever, be enough to lead to a conviction. In many cases, it's not footage of the incident itself that will be the most important piece of evidence. If you would like to read more about the legal nature of crime and how lawyers go about proving a case, then check out the Witness Guide, Anatomy of a Crime, in the Resources section below.